up everybody, Pengasman here for another episode on YouTube. Today I've got for you, uh, I get the uh, wraps on uh, Nuketown with a uh, pistol using the um, MR6. So uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoy it. Uh, be sure to give me a sub and uh, hit that like and catch you next time. Later. Okay, so let's get straight into this guys. Um, yeah, we're joining this one on the second half of the uplink on Nuketown. Um, I'm going to show you the first half because basically I just wanted to show you guys me getting the wraps of a, a pistol. I get it like right near the end of the game, so it's a bit crap, but it's pretty cool because I've got wraps of a pistol. So, um, yeah, the class setup is a pistol with the uh, MR6 with an ELO scope and high caliber and extended mode. And uh, my um, perks were attack mask, scavenger, and flat jacket. I'll uh, show you the picture here, so that if uh, you prefer seeing it as an image, then, then yeah, here you go. Um, yeah, so yeah, I'm really psyched for the new DLC that's coming out. Um, it's going to be sick. I don't think there's actually been given a date for it yet, but I'm assuming that. It's going to be the 19th of May because it came out on PS for uh, uh, PlayStation 4 and PlayStation 3 uh, April 19th. So I'm hoping we get it roughly around the same time a month later. It'll be useful. Um, I will be doing a lot of videos of that, so be sure to give a sub or yeah, keep an eye on my channel and. We, yeah, uh, I haven't actually seen any trailers for it, so I can't really tell you much about it, but I'm looking forward to it. Um, I also do PC gaming, but I haven't actually put any of that up on uh, YouTube, because I generally play um, hardcore survivals like DayZ and uh, H1Z1. Um, I just normally stream them because they're a lot longer, so I don't know if you guys would prefer to see some, uh, some footage of that on a uh, PC. Um, I, I, I mean, I'm a, I'm a full gamer, so I game on every platform. If I had enough money, I'd buy myself a PS4 as well. But right now, I don't, so... But yeah, um, basically, on this one, I think I have it set up so that um, I've got combat focus as well, so that when I use that, it allows me to get my uh, score streaks a lot quicker, so... Yeah. You might know so I did get them a lot quicker. But, um, you know, get, getting those, like, getting that melee and, uh, you know, getting this, uh, it all helps, it all adds up. And luckily, I just, yeah, I guess I'm just lucky that I was in the right place at the right time. And they had a thingy going over as well, so that helps me out. Uh, this pistol is pretty good, so I suggest it to anyone who uh, plays Call of Duty. Um, yeah, I, I've only just started using it to tell you the truth, but so far with high calibre I'm getting the headshots in. I think I've got more than 50 already and I've only used it for a couple of days. Um, I don't normally use the camos and change my camos, I normally just stick with some of the black market ones just because I prefer them I guess. But yeah, in this game I end up going, um, I think I got 38 for 14, which isn't bad for pistol, and, and getting my wraps as well, which uh, and my wraith. Isn't, um, which, yeah, I don't know, probably assume people would do better, but I'm, I'm pretty chuffed with that, so I thought I'd share it with you guys and uh, let you guys see for yourself. Um, but, yeah, um, I'm gonna probably test out some of the other pistols and see if I can uh, get Wraith or get something better with like a uh, pistol, maybe get a mothership. But, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it, and um, yeah, be sure to hit that sub and uh. Hit that like and catch you guys next time. Cheers. Layers.